Natumia nafasi hii kwa shukuru sana kampuni ya Serengeti Breweries Limited kwa uamuzi wenu wa kuiteua kilacha miongoni mwa vio vingi vya aina hii vya serikali hali kadhalika vya binafsi kuwa mnufaika wa mpango wa ufadhili wa kilimo viwanda hapa nchini na tumaini kuna vigezo mlivyotumia na kilacha imenufaika kukidhi vigezo hivyo Mheshimiwa Mkurugenzi Mtendaji Jimbo Katoliki Moshi lilianzisha chuo cha kilacha miaka 40 iliyopita kwa madhumuni makuu matatu La kwanza ni kuwajengea uwezo vijana wa Tanzania katika taaluma ya kilimo na ufugaji. Pili ni kutoa nafasi za ajira kwa vijana wa Tanzania kupitia kilimo na ufugaji. Na tatu kuzalisha ziada itakayotumika kuendeshea mafunzo na huduma nyingine kwa kanisa na kwa jamii. Katika kutekeleza Madhumuni haya kilacha tumekuwa tukiendesha miradi ya kilimo na ufugaji ili kupata fedha za kutoa ruzuku ya mafunzo. Aidha huu ni mwanzo wa ushirikiano utakaochangia kufikia malengo yetu matatu niliyoyataja hapo mwanzoni. Mheshimiwa sana Mkurugenzi Mtendaji Mark Ochiti Serengeti Breweries Limited ni kampuni kubwa na ya kimataifa na ina mahusiano na wadau wengi nje na ndani ya nchi yetu. Tunatoa ombi ninapoona inafaa mtuunganishe na wadau wenye malengo yanayofanana na yetu ili kwa pamoja tuweze kuboresha sekta ya kilimo viwanda. Aidha Nichukue fursa hii kuiomba serikali yetu ya Tanzania kupitia wizara zinazohusika na kilimo na ufugaji kuunga mkono juhudi zetu kwa kufadhili baadhi ya wanafunzi kwa kutoa ruzuku ya mafunzo vifaa vya kufundishia vitabu na hata walimu pia msamaa wa kodi kwa vifaa vya ujenzi na hata magari Kwani wote tuna lengo moja kuu la kumuendeleza kila mtanzania. Ili kilimo chetu kiwe chenye tija, ni lazima kuwepo na wataalamu wa kilimo wa kutosha ambao watafanya kazi bega kwa bega na wakulima na kuwaelekeza namna bora ya kulima na kutumia mazao, kutunza mazao yao ili waweze kupata mavuno mengi zaidi na hivyo kujiongezea kipato. Kwa namna ya pekee leo tunashukuru tunashuhudia tutashuhudia chuo cha mafunzo ya kilimo na ufugaji kikitia saini mkataba wa makubaliano utakao tuwezesha sisi kutoka katika kampuni ya Serengeti itusaidie katika kuwapa scholarship kwa wanafunzi wetu Mwisho Ningependa kutoa shukrani maalum kwa tukio hilo ambalo tutalishuhudia leo. Ni jambo la kufurahisha kwa ufadhili huu utatolewa kwa wanafunzi wanaotoka kwenye familia zenye kipato cha chini na ambazo haziwezi kumudu gharama za kusomesha vijana wao. Ni dhahiri kuwa ufadhili utakuwa chachu katika kubadilisha maisha ya kielimu ya wanafunzi wanaomfaika ambao wengine wamekuwa wakilazimika kukatisha masomo kwa kukosa haki. Uh, it's a scholarship uh, scholarship program that is in part, that is a partnership by SBL and the agricultural colleges that are the training centers for a total of 50 students which the program aims to benefit this year. Today in this institute 10 students of this college 
are receiving their scholarships, bringing to total the number of 20 uh, scholars who have benefited from the program so far. The first batch of the 10 scholarship students, uh, 10 scholarships were given out last month to the students of Kaolen Wazazi Agriculture College, based in Kamoyo. As you're aware, the Serengeti Brewery's value chain uses agricultural produce as raw material for beer production. We use barley, maize, and sorghum, which we source from local farmers across the country. Last year alone, we sourced 17,000 metric tons of these grains locally which is an equivalent of 70% of the total raw material that we use for production of our beer. We currently source these cereals from around 400 farmers around the country, but located in eight specific regions. And these regions are Kilimanjaro, where we are today, Arusha, Manyara, Singida, Dodoma, Shinyanga, Mwanza, and Mara and we plan to expand this program even further than those eight regions. We support the farmers in these regions by providing them with free seed, field technical services, and linking them to financial institutions to access credit facilities. We envisage to increase our local sourcing of materials to 85% by the end of this year, 2020, in line with our company's growth trajectory. But for us to realize this objective, it is imperative that we support the government of Tanzania in building capacity of our farmers through training of experts in the agricultural sector and in agricultural fields of study, which is why we are doing this. It is for this reason that Serengeti Brewery started Kilimo Biwanda Scholarship Program, on which we have set aside over 120 billion Tanzania shillings every year for the next few years to pay tuition for needy students from farming communities studying agriculture related courses. Kwa jina naitwa Kefa. Ni mwanafunzi nasoma General Agriculture ngazi ya diploma. Kwa kweli changamoto ninazo kutana nazo labda kubwa ni masuala ya practical. Yanakuta masuala ya vifaa vya kufanyia practical practical kwa zile moja kwa moja kwa vitendo tunavikosa. Uh, labda serikali tuongeze wataalamu kwanza tuseme madokta wale watu waliobobea kwenye ngazi ya mifugo. Mm. Kwa mfano tupate vitu kama tufundishwe upasuaji ni mtu anafanya upasuaji unaona kuzalisha sio kufanyaje masuala yote yale yanayohusiana na mifugo tunapata kwa vitendo. Masuala yote kutibu kufanyaje unajua kabisa sio kuishia kufundishwa darasani. Mm. Mwanzo tunakutana nazo hasa katika mazingira halisi ya chuoni na hata huko tunakokwenda field kwamba tunakuta tuna vitabu vichache sana pia kwa na yale tuseme kufanya e, kujifunza kwa njia vitendo pia tunakutana sana moto nyingi tukana na vitendo vingi ama vitu vingi vinakopo havipo kutokana na uaba mm. ya yeye yeah, ambavyo tunaje pale chuoni kwetu na pia tukienda mtaani pia changamoto ni nyingi kwa sababu nakuta wakulima wengi sana wanapitia changamoto nyingi na ambazo sisi tukienda tukiangalia kunaweza kufika kwa mkulima mkulima ambaye haelewi kitu chochote. Kwa hiyo ile unao kuanza unavoanza kumuelezea ili aweze kufahamu basi kidogo inakuwa ni wabishi. Lakini kwa sababu tumesoma somo moja inaitwa dissemination na na extension kwa tunajua namna gani tunaohendo mpaka mwisho wa siku tunaelewana. Ya serikali kwa upande wa chochetu au pamoja kwa wanafunzi pia wenzetu ambao wako pale tunaomba itusaidie sana hasa kutupa 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 walimu wa kutosha walimu wa zoefu pia vite, vi, vi, vifaa vya kufundishia cha vifaa vya kufundishia vigo vya maabara pia tuwe na practical nyingi ambazo zinaweza zikatusaidia sisi kutujenga tukawa tuko vizuri si focus leo ni mwanafunzi wa stashahada ya mifugo afya mifugo pamoja na uzalishaji kwa ujio wa Serengeti Brewers ni furaha kwetu kwa sababu inatusaidia sisi katika kutulipia ada kwa sisi hapo tunaweza kufikia malengo yetu ambayo yatatusaidia kuwasaidia wengine ambao bado wako mtaani hawana elimu kuhusu mifugo na afya ya mifugo uzalishaji pamoja na uzalishaji kwa hapa chuoni 
changamoto ambazo ni ukosefu kwa sisi wanafunzi wa afya mifugo ni mashahidi changamoto kubwa ni ukosefu wa daktari wa mifugo ambao wanatusaidia kutufundisha kuhusu mifugo unakuta tunafundishwa tu kwa nadharia vitendo amna kwa sababu daktari ni mmoja wa mifugo kwa hiyo tunaomba labda tungepata daktari ambaye atakuwa zaidi ambao atakuwa msaidia sisi katika kutufundisha kwa vitendo ili tueleweze zaidi tunafanya mtaani tukwasiliana na wafugaji huko mtaani ili kuwa mwanafamilia bora wa Global TV usisahau kusubscribe, like, kushare na kucomment. Baada ya kusubscribe, bonyeza alama ya kengele ili kupata taarifa kwa kila video inayopanda Global TV.